good afternoon. If you have a question, raise your hand. We'll get started here. Chris? Do you have any updates on uh, Quitty Pay or Sean for this week? Um, not not uh, any updates yet, no. Okay. All right, John? How would you assess in general, special teams play to this point of the season, and are there any facets of it that have particularly stuck out as, as exceptional to you? Yeah, um, there's been, uh, I think the play's been, overall, for the uh, season has been really good. We've gotten uh, turnovers, we've gotten stops, uh, kickoff coverage has been really good. Uh, punting unit, uh, overall, has been very good. Punt return, we've had, uh, we've had our moments. I think we're hitting our stride there with the punt return unit. And same with uh, kickoff return. And uh, kickers and, and punters have, have uh, are off to a good start for the season. On the far left, Larry, uh, has Dylan McCaffrey been recruited to play? Still working through the process. Yeah. Progressing. Uh, been fantastic, really. There's been... Uh, Really, the best I've seen of I mean, collaboration, both with here at Michigan, medicine, and, and doctors from from home in Denver, and some uh, experts all over the country. Uh, it's been it's been been really good. But uh, tip of the hat to the uh, the professionals. Uh, Can you give us a doubtful about what kind of uh, status for him for Saturday? No. It's, process in the hands of the, the experts. Back left. Casey. Kind of going back to special teams. Uh, have you decided on a good have you decided on kick for Jeff between Norman and Moody or is that still what you still want on? Yeah, we've decided on both. Okay. Right, thanks. Yeah. I'd like to both uh, both really kicking well. And uh, I think they're they're in a good Good rhythm. I think they um, they're they're confident with with uh, their preparation and, and with flow and in, in, in game. That's the, the feedback from them and also from what we see. So it's just splitting time between them. Yeah. No front left here. Team effort. Jim, after the game on Saturday, Shea mentioned you need to punch at the end zone a little bit more. You guys have. How did you assess your offense as red zone? Uh, I think the red zone's been a, been a, been something that's been good for us. Um, and as I said after the game, I think um, you know, I, I feel like we're very close offensively and, and very close to hitting hitting the stride of hitting on all cylinders. Um, have really good uh, really good evidence to back that up, and uh, and also. What I see. Here. I know that uh, Brandon Peterson's status is uncertain, but how would you assess his career in Michigan? Uh, really like Brandon a lot, uh, and uh, I think he won us won us ball games. Uh, good person, good player. Uh, been following him, and, and uh, yeah, I would say the same for how he's playing there uh, at Illinois. Uh, Good guy, good player. On that note, I mean, how would you evaluate, you know, your quarterback development of the prospects that you recruited during your tenure from high school? Um, to go back through every every quarterback that we've had? Well, not just every, I mean, just in general, how would you assess just, you know, how you guys have done developing quarterbacks that you've recruited from high school? Huh. Rather not talk. Talk about uh, toot my own horn, or, or you know, don't like talking about myself. Middle here, Chris. Josh Ross, uh, do you expect him back? And if when you get him back, how does that affect the rotation inside? Uh, I don't think he'll be back this week. Uh, when he's back, we'll we'll assess it. You know, somebody um, somebody comes back to play, and you see where they're at, and where that where that stands with some of the other. Players that are out there. Talk about how those two guys have fared in his absence. Yeah, um, 
Jordan Glasgow, one of the leading tacklers in the game, uh, you know, really had a, he had a really good game again this past week, multiple tackles and uh, he um, he was in coverage. Uh, there was one play where he was in coverage, and the next play he's making a sack. Uh, very versatile player. Cam McGrone is is also uh, obviously an ascending player and, and doing quite well. Another. Uh, really solid, good game for Cam McGrone. Uh, both those linebackers are playing really well. So. The, the NCAA, uh